folks, how y'all doing today? Today we are taking a look at the Crossbreed Mini Tuck Holster, left-handed, for the Ruger LCP Max. And as you can see, that fits on there really nice. Molded to the gun, there is absolutely no wobble or play whatsoever. We've got excellent retention. And this is just a very, very nice holster from a very good American-made uh, company. And uh, it's a Christian company, which means a lot to me. And this is a really nice holster. Now, what makes it hybrid is that you've got a Kydex shell with a flexible leather or neoprene backer on it. Right here. You see? So that's cool. It's nice and comfortable. You've got wide dual clips. So this wraps all the way around your hip. And gives you a really nice, secure, comfortable fit. I believe two, a couple other holsters in the past. And uh, I was very pleased with both of them. They were both very nice. This has good, high-quality metal clips. Six rivets. There's no way it's going to come loose. Uh, the clips are adjustable. You can adjust the uh, height. You've got dual mounting screw height. So you can uh, pick the height you're most comfortable with uh, for deep concealment or high-rise. And you've also got an FBI cant built directly into the holster here, as you can see. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try this holster on. And we're going to uh, do a couple draws with it and let you see how it conceals. Okay, folks. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the holster. It's going to wrap around your hip like this. and makes it very secure. You don't get a lot of wobble back and forth. It's a very secure way to carry a holster and very comfortable. So I'm going to get this guy on and we'll do a couple draws. got this at the four o'clock you can see we've got dual clip and it's very stable the holster is very secure it won't lift or pull out by accident let me grab a hold of this and tug you see even i don't even have a belt on it and that's really in there very securely and as you can see we're at the four o'clock position so we can seal really nicely and we're going to do a couple draws from four o'clock so you can see how fast this guy is all right here we go I finally get to do a demonstration with a left-handed holster. Most of the holsters I review are right-handed. I'm left-handed. I'm actually getting pretty good drawing right-handed. So it'll be nice to draw with my left hand for once. So what you're going to do is reach way across, pull, and lift your garment off, and draw the pistol. You can see, nice and fast, no problem, you know. Pocket pistols are notoriously not particularly well known for being fast to draw, but as you can see with this, no problem. The grip on the LCP Max is just big enough to fill my whole hand right here, as you can see. Okay, so it, it's it's like carrying a full-size pistol in a way because it's a stack and a half. It's nice and wide, and I've got some excess big dot sights on here. I'll post a link to that all this stuff in the description. This whole gun's pimped out with Galloway Precision Parts. I'll... Post all that on the end screen, okay? This is a really nice pistol. I carry this at all times. I love it. All right, let me try this again. And as you can see, very fast, very fast draw. Okay, folks, this was a basic straightforward demonstration of the Crossbreed Super Tuck holster. Really nice holster. Uh, very compact as far as a hybrid holster goes. A lot of times, you know, hybrid holsters can be a, a bit bulkier. But this one is nice and streamlined. It fits your uh, around your hip really nicely. It's very stable. No play, no wiggle. And again, the retention is fantastic on this guy. So this is a high-quality holster. And it's American-made. And they're a Christian company. And I think that this is a great holster company to support. So that's the Crossbreed Mini Tuck Holster for the Ruger LCP Max in left or right hand. All right, folks, appreciate your time. Thanks for watching, folks. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Read my meme out.